previous versions, you could not mix and match both automatically and manually delineated catchments for a single inlet. In this version, now you can. Not only can you mix and match or use both for an inlet, automatically delineated catchments will honor the boundary of manually delineated catchments. Let's see how this works. Notice in the utility properties on the drainage tab, there's this new property, delineation type. Now it's either automatic or manual. You can change the setting as required. When we upgrade existing data, the delineation type will be set to automatic by default so that any automatically delineated catchments will continue to update. So if I pick the node here and move it slightly, the catchment updates. Let's place a new catchment, just as we did previously. Pick points, so there's that area of field that I want to drain and we'll assign it to that same outflow node. Now let's pick that node and we'll move it again. And you see how the automatically delineated area will update. If I pick the area that I manually created, you can see that the delineation type for it is set to manual as opposed to automatic for that one. If I pick this manual one and I drag some vertices and we'll just overlap that um, automatically delineated area. If I pick that inlet again and move it, you can see how the automatically delineated area is now aware of the manual area and it wraps itself around the edge of the manual catchment area. If I select that manual area again and change is active to false and then move the inlet again You can see how the automatically delineated area updates itself again, and this time ignores the manual area because the manual area is not active in this scenario.